Look, I agree the food stinks, but if you think it's that terrible, just pack your own lunch. No way, man. I'd have to wake up early for that. Oh no, an extra five minutes? I spent at least an hour making sure my makeup looks good. Consider yourself lucky. That much time? Uh, on makeup? Just because there aren't any hot boys here now doesn't mean it'll be that way forever. Well, there are beautiful girls here, so I'll spend quite a bit of my time making sure my hair looks decent. Your hair looks good today. I, 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 I didn't even do my hair today. I, I slept in. Oh, well, I see no difference from yesterday. Then uh, maybe from now on, I shouldn't worry about it. I'd rather spend that time in the morning sleeping anyways. Um, Zach, excuse me? Huh? This is the part where you say, oh yeah, Ryan, don't worry about looking good for girls, and Megan, don't stress about looking good for guys. Megan, you look great no matter what. Good save. Uh, anyways, where's Mark? I feel lonely without my new pal. Uh, Bert, I don't think he exactly likes us. What? Of course he does. Or he wouldn't have played Y-Cube with us yesterday. I have to agree with Bert. He does like you. He's just a bit uh, special. That that sounds like special. Does it mean special? D did I get it right? Uh, yes. Mark is sort of a lone wolf from what I can tell. He doesn't have many friends and doesn't seem to want any. Then how did you guys get so close so quickly? Were you all friends before school started? No, oddly enough, we did meet here. He saw me in the auditorium looking for my schedule and I couldn't find it, so I got flustered, and whenever I get flustered, uh, yo habla en español y... Whoa, 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 slow down, Ash. No understando Spanish, oh. <sighs> I don't either, but could you teach me? That way, if you ever do get flustered, I can understand why and be around to help. That's very kind of you, but it would take a while, and... I don't care how long it'll take. We're friends, and the friends are supposed to be there for each other. Please? Okay, uh, but we have to start simply. I can begin by teaching you how to say food things so we can communicate during lunch. For example, this chicken I'm eating, it's called pollo. Po? Yo? No, pollo. That's what I said! <laughs> no, never mind, it's uh, uh, never mind. Uh, oh, strawberries are called fresas. Fresh us? Fresh us? No. Oh, here's an easy one. Your grapes are uvas. Uvas? Yes, exactly. Piece of cake. Pastel. Uvas? <laughs> 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 Why am I even teaching this class if nobody's paying attention to me? Hello? Okay, mathematics is very simple thing. Because two plus two, what does that equal five? Nobody paying attention? Okay, good. Aren't you going to say anything? Nope. But why not? They're the upperclassmen here. They run the school, not me. All that snitching would do is get me a black eye. It's mean, though. Bullies will be bullies. There's nothing you can do except not respond. That way, uh, they'll find it boring and they stop. They don't seem to be stopping. Just, do you trust me? I mean, we've only known each other for a little while, but I think I do trust you at this point, yes? Then trust me on this, okay? Uh, no, you- Please, believe me when I say I know how to handle this situation. Uh, fine. Is this normal in America? More than you'd think, yeah. Do you two have something you'd like to say to the class? Uh, yes, I... No, sir. Good. Then refrain from talking during my lecture. But... Yes, sir. Brian, we have to tell him. Not gonna happen. <laughs> oh, heck no! <laughs> Got him right there. Listen here. You mess with me all you want, but you do anything to screw with Ash, and that's when you're gonna make me angry. Never throw anything at her ever again. Understand me? I'm so sorry. It will never happen again. Ryan. I... I have to go. Um, anyways, as I was saying, the short stories we'll be analyzing this year uh, will have much more meaning than anything you examined in middle school. Ash, please take your seat. We'll read a variety of literature, including some poems and, uh, well... Ash, sit down, please. 
Nobody else is allowed to leave this classroom until I say so. Are you okay? I'm fine. You know, back in Mexico, I was really shy. I didn't have many friends and I didn't know how to talk to many people. I could have been called anti-social. Even though I rarely had conversations with people, I know that fine is a danger word. I'm okay. You promise? Ooh, on a scale of 1 to 10. What? On a scale of 1 to 10, how are you feeling? A 10. I can't help you if you won't let me. Alright, like... like an 8? Ryan... Why does it matter? There's nothing you can do anyway. Nothing I can do? I thought we were friends. We are! Apparently not. You said it yourself earlier today. Friends are always there for each other. And for whatever reasons, you're hiding it from me. You don't want me to be there for you. I... you know, I didn't... Uh, fine. In complete and total honesty, I'm probably a four right now. Because of the bully? Yep. You didn't care so much in the beginning. Because he wasn't messing with you. What do I have to do with it? I'm used to it. They shouldn't do anything to you. Remember how I said I didn't have many friends back in Mexico? I'm used to it too. The only difference is I would always stand up for myself. I don't care if you're used to it or not. It's not allowed to happen to you. Hey, calmate. <sighs> I assume you just told me to calm down. Sorry. Don't apologize. I think it's adorable how nicely you're treating me. Did, did, did you just call me adorable? No, I called your behavior adorable. Ah, yo no dice. Ah, tú eres linda, pero. Then why are you getting all flustered? Hmm. <clears throat> I don't know what you're talking about. At lunch, you said- I didn't say anything at lunch. You must have a bad memory. Okay, I admit, I do, but- Anyways, um, feeling better? Surprisingly, yeah. Why is that a surprise? I mean, I just, I don't open up very easily. And you've managed to figure out how to get me to talk in a matter of minutes. Whereas my other friends still can't do it. And I've known them for years. I'm pretty good at that. I can tell. It's kind of scary. Are you ready to go back inside? Not yet. But you just said... I'm okay. I just... I need a minute more. Alright. Stay here with me? Oh, I... Of course. <laughs> hey, buddy! I'm studying. When aren't you? <laughs> um, so how was your- My day has been fine. Well, that's good. Yep. So, uh, my day was pretty awesome. We all missed you at lunch, though. Uh, wh where were you? In the library. I knew Ash wouldn't be alone because you'd ask her to sit with you. So I didn't feel bad about that. Uh, well, nonetheless, we all wish you were there. I'm sure. Uh, so what you reading? My biology textbook. You're reading a textbook for fun? It, you're in biology? I thought that was a sophomore class. I'm in earth science. It's not for fun. It's to keep my grades up. And yes, it is an advanced class. But if I want to be valedictorian of my grade, then I have to make sure I have a perfect GPA and harder classes in my schedule. Whoa, but we basically graduate in four years. And you're already looking that far ahead? I have to. Uh, why? Look, don't worry about it, okay? We aren't friends, so I'm not even sure why you care so much. <laughs> Did I say something to amuse you? Well, duh! You just said we weren't friends! That was a really good joke. I didn't know you had it in ya! <laughs> ah, well, my bus is about to leave, so I I've gotta go, but we'll, we'll talk tomorrow, okay? See ya, pal. No, I, I don't- Ugh! You're supposed to support me! I do support you. Then why didn't you agree with me when I told the teacher it was only the second day of school and receiving homework should be a crime? I stood up for myself, but you didn't help. Megan, I would have gotten in trouble. 
Well, I did get in trouble, and now I have to sit in lunch detention all by myself tomorrow. I'm sorry, all right? <laughs> I'm not actually mad, Zach. I thought you would have known me by now. You should never take me seriously. Chances are, no matter the situation, I'm always just trying to have some fun and joke around. But if I didn't take you seriously and you were actually serious, then you would have flipped out at me. Also true. But come on, when's the last time I was serious? I mean, other than the whole me yelling at the teacher thing, I was very serious about that and I still think that homework is a social construct meant to- Chill out, you dork. Next time you get yourself in a mess. You'll clean it up for me, right? Nope. I'll just make the mess worse so we both suffer the terrible consequences together. Good. Now walk me home? You know it. Mm -hmm.